Tell me more. Perfect. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a morning routine with a newborn. In this video, Nathaniel is about two months old and you'll get to see how our mornings were when he was at this age. So of course, you have to start the morning out with some morning stretches. He's so cute. Then it's time for a little breakfast. This is actually his second bottle for the morning. At this point in time, it was probably about 9 a.m. And we had had a pretty early start, so probably about 6 a.m., but I didn't start the video there because it's pretty unpredictable what will happen before at about 9 p.m. So usually around 9, 8.30 to 9 is when our morning really gets going, and so that's what I'm showing you here. So as I feed him some expressed milk, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and like this video if you want to see more content. So usually after I will feed him, I'm not sure, sometimes he'll go down right away for a nap and sometimes he would just stay awake and just kind of hang out a little bit. So I'm trying to be as productive as I can. It's like such a struggle to actually get things done when you are caring for a newborn, but I was determined to make the bed <laughs> so that we didn't actually sit in the bed all day. There were times early on in Nathaniel's life and early on in my postpartum experience where sometimes we hardly left the bed. It was just easy, it was comfortable. But um, here I am just making up the bed while he's hanging out, looking at the blinds, looking out the window. That's one of his favorite things to do. Another thing that we would do in the morning is we would sing songs. I so enjoyed singing songs with Nathaniel. I still do. We have the same playlist uh, that we sing from over and over. There's plenty of children's songs on Spotify. Um, I specifically would sing Christian songs with him, but they have non-Christian songs, all kinds of just nice kitty songs that you can sing that um, he would actually really respond to. I could tell that there were certain songs that he liked more than others, and we would just have a really good time. Some days we would get through one or two songs, and some days we'd get through the whole playlist, which I think at this time was probably about five or six songs. So it just depended on his mood, his energy level, and whatever else we had been doing in the morning. Another thing that he was doing at this age was putting his hand to his mouth. I think he was like really discovering that he could touch his mouth and that he knew where his mouth was. So he would do a lot of this hand to mouth action. And at that time, my husband and I, we would just crack up. We loved to see it. We just loved to see all his milestones and all his growth. Then, of course, after all the singing, so much energy that you use to sing, he would be so tired and he'd be going down for his first or second nap. Here, I believe this was his second nap for the morning because, like I said before, we did have an earlier start to the morning than we usually did. So he's going down for his second nap of the morning. So that means that I get to eat breakfast. <laughs> so I basically would eat as quickly as I could, but try to enjoy myself, try to just relax, kind of scroll through social media. If you want to see what I ate at this time while I was breastfeeding or expressing milk, um, go ahead and like this video. So he is woken up from his nap. He looks so cute, so rested. Uh, this is when we were coming to the tail end of swaddling him, um, and he really didn't need super tight swaddles either. It was really just to keep his arms away from his face. As you see, we have the mitts on his hands because he was just loving to claw at his face at this time. Um, so now he doesn't really do that as much now that he is about four months old. So here it's just some kisses and cuddle time. This is just like the highlight of my day, even though I feel like we would do this so much throughout the day. I just loved to be close so that he could see me, talk to him, kiss him, hug him, and just have a conversation with him. It was really interesting to kind of mimic some of the same sounds he made and, you know, say other words so he'd look at right at my mouth. And of course, my husband had to come and get in on some of the action. We just loved this time with him and we still do. He is just such a light 
and joy to our home. And oh my goodness, just looking at this, I'm just like, ah, oh, he's growing up so fast, but he's just so lovely, such a wonderful baby. He would just have like the softest little coos and just, oh, you would just melt as you looked into his eyes. And I'm just so glad that I have this footage and that I can share it with you all. He loved to also go into his play gym. This is the Love Every Play Gym. This video is not sponsored, but this gym really is amazing. He loves all the little elements, and I could see as he's developing more and more that he would notice other things and reach for certain things and different areas of the mat. So it's just great to really track development. So as he's in the gym, I do get to get a little bit of stuff done around the house, mostly sterilize his bottles and clean up the kitchen from breakfast and that's pretty much it because who knows when he's gonna cry but this morning I was actually able to get in a shower I'd say before 2 p.m. which was definitely a great thing so after I did get out of the shower I had to quickly kind of regroup I was trying to pump as you can see I am wearing my cordless uh, pump but baby Nathaniel was starting to get a little bit tired and my husband had a meeting, so I was trying to swaddle him. Even though I do love these uh, pumps that, you know, the cordless pumps, it doesn't make it easy necessarily to hold the baby. So I'm trying to swaddle him as best as I can without leaning too far forward. But these pumps really are amazing. Again, not sponsored. I didn't even mention the specific brand of the pump. But I had to express milk because at this point I was trying to exclusively pump for Nathaniel. So this is him just going down for another nap. And he didn't really take long naps at this point in time. So he was probably down for about 15 minutes if he even really went down at all. And I am still just pumping and trying to keep him occupied because it's, like I said before, I can't really pick him up at this time, but um, he's just having fun laying in the bed and staring and cooing. And then we had another diaper change for the morning. And after I change his diaper, if we have the time, I like to just look in his little mirror and show him himself. And I just wonder what he thinks. If he, I know that he doesn't know that that's him in the mirror, but um, it's just fun to kind of have a little bit of mirror play with him at this age. And that's our morning. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.